Alright guys, well, here is the uh, front um, hubcaps I had given to me a while back. Or not given to me, uh, I bought off eBay, I mean, I've got, this one kind of told, you know, talking. They're the ones I was given. But anyways, um, these are the ones I bought. They had all of the surf stores on them. I got them all cleaned up for the most part. These ones were uh, not so... Not so good. These are all rusty and whatnot. Thought maybe I could get them all cleaned up, but uh, with steel wool. But they were just so bad. I didn't really put it this way. Turn one around and it looked like this. Yeah, it's pretty bad. So uh, <laughs> I took my. Uh, I got a sander from the Dremel and just started sanding them up. Um, I got this one all done. Pretty much except for the, the circle there. Um, this one, uh, I haven't got the metal done yet. And then I haven't got the, uh, the international logo taken out yet. But, uh, I've been thinking about just turning these over to just a regular hub caps get some uh, fill or something and then fill them in and uh, and then probably paint them gray probably that or try to find some halfway decent chrome uh, spray paint spray paint them I don't know I haven't decided yet but uh, I think I'm gonna put them on the green green machine that or Possibly the, the mower, but not too sure yet. So, but this this one's got the uh, <coughs> ooh, excuse me, the front ones. So, um, but yeah, yep, yep, hooray! Thinking I had up here. Yeah, that's right. I got a pair on those, on that too. I got three fronts. Yeah, I got three fronts and uh, one rear. <laughs> so I gotta find. Uh, well, technically, I gotta find one more front and uh, three rears. So, but I'll get there eventually. But uh, but yeah, I do all this and then pull this one forward so I can. Uh, Move that one out here where this one is. Can we're working on it and see how the hood caps look and whatnot. So but it's uh I'm out here in a sweatshirt and it's uh, about 45, 50 degrees. Not very much wind. A little bit of wind. But uh the uh, the barns block it off pretty good so I don't really feel it. But yeah, so uh, up there they're pretty much done I guess, I don't know if they're just done because of the cold weather or, or they had so much trouble getting up in there with the trucks or and they're planning on coming back, I don't know, but uh, I was going to get a video, I tried to get a video of them uh, Loading up all the machinery and moving it out and whatnot, but went to go videotape it and I got like, <laughs> I don't know, 15 20 seconds of it. And uh, the camera decided to tell me that the battery is pretty much shot, so I need to be charged. But, uh, try. Okay, let's see here. Let's try this differently. Try to get to sit down here so I can zoom in and you guys can see better. And I'm not really sure to get uh okay, no. Hold on guys, let me just try and see here. Okay. Okay, sturdy it out here. See the 
log right there that's cut. More up, more, it looks like more wood up in there. Looks like it's stacked. Shrubs. But, uh, right in there where that, whoa, almost slipped. <laughs> Nothing but ice back behind me, guys. And I'm stepping on, so try not to make a whole bunch of mess up. But right there is where that, uh, that trailer with the, uh, the welder, or the grapple, I mean, was sitting. But, uh, here, let's hit the dozer, the, the uh, skitter, the, the grapple out. Yeah, so, took everything out, so, I uh, they were just doing a little bit of wood up in there. But, once they're coming back when it's not so wintry and muddy or what, because, <laughs> well, first, like I said, they, uh, had made this road over here. Right here. Going up in there. It made that road. Hold on guys, got cars in So yeah, they had made this road here. You can see all new stone. It was all up there, but they get right about halfway in between that hill right there and they can't make it no more because it was gravel so that was a waste of gravel right there and then of course they had to dig up the field there make a new road and then zigzags over here and then zigzags up there and zigzags over so how mushy this is. Yeah, mushy. Mushy, mushy mess. I think the only hard spot in my whole yard is up here. <laughs> nice and hard up in here. No mushiness or nothing. Probably because all these trees soak it up pro. But, uh, you'd think it'd be, you know, a lot of mushy up here, here actually, but uh, it really ain't, except for you know, a little bit of, a little mushy right here, and it gets hard again, but uh, it's extremely mushy right there, you can see all the ruts in the tractor. There's the old carpet from the living room. I haven't got a chance to cut it up in small pieces and throw it in the uh, trash can. But, yeah, the whole mushy mo part is right in here. That's it. But, not a whole lot of water down in there for everything thawing out. Ice and snow right there in the tunnel. That tunnel is like huge. It's taller than me on 5'4. So, you can't really tell it from looking at it, but uh, probably about probably almost tall as my shed right there. It's that one's the same height. So but uh this one just looks tall because it's up off the ground. Instead of that one. But uh yeah anyways they're eight foot high. Just the uh and then from the uh Actually, ground to the peak is, I believe, 
11, 11 or 12 probably. Somewhere around in there. Ugh, muddy, muddy, muddy mess. <laughs> I haven't gone down yet, so. AKA slipping. <laughs> I'm pretty good. But uh, when it comes to ice skating, I suck. <laughs> I probably have actual unbalance for that, but. Oh well. But, yeah, here's the plow. Um, yeah. Needs quite a bit of work done to it. Some adjusting and whatnot. But, uh, I don't know. But I'm just gonna trade it off to my buddy. Um, for that custom plow back. And uh, if I, even if I did want to use this, I'd have to take. Can we all see this or not? There's a bar right there, that hook. I'd have to take that bar hook off. And it's just a pain in the ass. So I gotta unbolt three bolts that hold the front half of that frame. I'll show you. Do 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 do. Where are you? Oh, where are you? Ah, there we go. Three bolts right there. This one's only got two bolts holding this, this handle on. The other side's got three. And then three bolts hold your front frame section on. I didn't have to do all, undo all three of them just to get that bar off. And I'm not really looking forward to doing it, so I'm not going to do it. Uh, I know the custom pot I had that I ended up selling on the Blue 15 I had. I know that would work perfect on here. I wouldn't have to remove anything. So, but, yeah, anyways. So I'm gonna get back to doing this and clean out the, the middle section of that real quick and then I'm gonna do this and then uh, call that good, throw them on there so I can figure out what color I want to put them. Would have been nice if, they're, if that chrome was saveable, but it's, it's really not so, but oh well. Alright guys, I've gabbed enough 